Hey guys, what's up? So today we're going to take a look at the Chevron Cars Sally School Bus. Um, so this is a model that I have that I haven't had a look or haven't had a chance to show you guys yet. So I figured I'd go ahead and uh, show you. So a little bit of background on Chevron Cars and Sally School Bus. Um, Sally School Bus was released in August of 2001, uh, August 2nd to be exact. Um, Chevron is a gas station in America, for those of you who aren't in America or don't know. Um, and basically, they started making Chevron cars uh, from a commercial series that they started in 1995 uh, for their Tecron gas. Um, so in 1996, they came out with the first uh, buyable uh, models like uh, of the cars from the commercials that you could get at the gas stations um, now They made models from 1996 up until I think the last model was maybe produced in 2010 I'm not exactly sure, but I know in 2011 uh, July 26 2011 Chevron uh, announced that they would not be making them anymore due to a uh, decrease in demand for them um, So now they're just kind of uh, you know something that it, you know it, It's interesting because ever since they stopped making them, you know with a lot of things as it usually goes, you know the um, Collectability goes up. So anyways enough of me talking. We're gonna go ahead and look at this today um, I'll show you the package and then we'll look at the bus itself. So on the first flap. You've got this wording um, it says if you've got an important job like Sally School Bus does, you need some important features, check it out. So first, you got the top, it comes off so you can check out the inside. You've got uh, rolling eyes when you push down on the wheels. Um, and then the thing that I find interesting is that the push button on the side of this bus opens the door and stop sign. So I think that's pretty cool um, with most models. Uh, that do have working doors and stop signs, you have to open them yourselves. And I know this is, you know, um, a really big model and stuff like that. Uh, but I just think it's really cool that it's got the button. Um, you can see the features. It tells you right there. Uh, but anyways, there's that. And then, keep your neighborhood clean. Chevron. And there she is. So I'm going to go ahead and take it out of the box. And we'll take a look at it forgot to show the bottom of this um, so you can see plenty of seats get on board top comes off so you can check out the inside stop sign and door flips out um, the button and uh, eyes move and then there's that so before we get to the bus we have this little uh, owner's manual for the bus um, you can see it says Sally school bus um, so on the front page basically um, you know, just got some literature and it tells you, uh, how it works and stuff like that. And there's an official driver's license that, uh, bus driver's license that you just, uh, put your name and address on. Um, now, let's see, let's open this up. It even comes with a little, uh, thing, I believe, uh, that you could put on the bottom of it. Uh, so you could, you know, write your name on it as the owner so that way you don't lose it. Um, and then there's some literature. Uh, you can pause to read it if you want, uh, and then we've got more literature up in the top, and uh, there's Sally School Bus, and um, just some more literature. Um, so this is pretty cool, um, and uh, you can read all that and stuff, and I mean, look at that computer. This just goes to show you how old this is, um, but yeah, chevroncars.com. I'm not sure if the website is still up. Um, I'll have to check that out, and I can put it in the description if it is. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and get to the model. Alright, so here we go. Uh, you can see it's actually a very big model compared to my hand. I mean, it's it's got a good size. Um, you can see the windows are all set at different uh, positions of being up and down. It says Chevron Cars Township. Um, got the stop sign there. On the back, uh, it says emergency exit, uh, Tecron, which is the gas that they have. Uh, and with these tail lights, it's got a very California uh, spec set up. Um, sometimes you'll see in California, the buses will have their tail lights uh, stacked instead of going across. 
Uh, personally, I would prefer it going across. I don't really care for the stacked style taillights, but that's just me. It's got the four ways and, you know, no black roof caps. So you can definitely tell that when this bus was being designed, uh, they were looking at a California spec bus, um, school bus. Um, and again, you've got windows at different levels. There's the door mirrors. There's the button to open the door. And uh, this is the top that comes out. Uh, you can see it's got little notches at each end to fit. And basically, you can just look in there, and there's like little things on the on the uh, seats and stuff, and you know stuff like that. Um, so now I will go ahead and demonstrate to you the um, stop sign and door. So this is the uh, button. So basically, you push it, the door flips open, um, and then and we'll see the stop sign do it. And now we'll see it do it all at once. So you hit the bot button, stop sign and door comes out at the same time. Now the other feature that I haven't shown you yet is the eyes. Um, so the eyes you can see they're kind of looking in one direction right now. But you basically just push down on the front axle. Now it might take a second for it to catch because it's been a while since I've had it out of the box. But basically you just push down on the axle and there you go. The eyes move. Um, so yeah, that's the Sally School Bus. Um, you know, I just thought I'd do a little review on this, show you guys what it um, looks like and how it works and stuff like that. Uh, so yeah, here's the bottom. In case you want to see it, the wheels are pretty big. Um, but all around, um, you know, I think it's a nice piece. Uh, sure, the face is kind of, I guess you could say it's kind of uh, childish, but... Uh, Personally, I, I think it's a great piece, and, you know, you know, it is collectible. Um, and I, I really like what Chevron did with the advertisements of the uh, cars and stuff with the faces. I remember when I was little, I was always interested in it and stuff like that. Um, so I don't know if the Chevron school bus ever made an appearance in one of the ads they did. Um, but I will go ahead and look, and if it does, I will include it in the video. Or in a, I will put a link in the description. Uh, you can see the warning lights are a little bit more... They're fuller on the front than they are in the back. They're thicker, that's what I'm trying to say. But yeah, so that's the Chevron Sally School Bus. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think. Oh, I know what I was going to ask. Personally, what kind of bus do you think this is uh, modeled after, uh, body-wise? Um, now here I can kind of see, and I know this is going to be weird, um... But if you look at this roof cap, it makes me think of an older Superior, um, the way it comes out, and then this. Uh, I'll put in a picture of what I'm talking about so you guys can see. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Tell me what you think.